Good afternoon boys and girls. My name is Uncle Varun and welcome to story time. Okay? So what we're going to do, we're going to listen to this wonderful story by yours truly, Uncle Varun. And the name of my story is The Gruffalo. The Gruffalo by our author is Miss Julia Donaldson and it's illustrated by Mr. Axel Schaffler. A mouse took a stroll through the deep dark woods. A fox saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. So the fox says, where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have lunch in my underground house. So the mouse says, It's wonderfully nice of you, no fox. But now, I'm going to have lunch with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? So the mouse says, A gruffalo? Why didn't you know? His eyes are orange. His tongue is black. He has purple prickles all over his back. So the fox says, Where are you meeting him? And the mouse says, Here, by these rocks. And his favorite food is roasted fox. Roasted fox. It's time I hid. Goodbye, little mouse. And away fox slip. <laughs> Silly old fox. Does he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? So on went the mouse to the deep dark woods. And the owl saw the mouse. And the mouse looked good. So the owl went, woo, woo, where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have tea in my treetop house. So the mouse says, it's frightfully nice of you now, owl. But no, I'm going to have tea with a gruffalo. So the owl says, a uh, gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? So the mouse says, a gruffalo? Why didn't you know? He has terrible tusks and terrible claws in his terrible teeth, in his terrible jaws. So the owl went, Where are you meeting him? And the mouse says, here, yeah, by this stream, and his favorite food is owl ice cream. Owl ice cream? To to who? Goodbye, little mouse. And away owl flew. <laughs> Silly old owl, does he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? So... On went the mouse to the deep dark woods and a snake saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. So the snake went, where are you going to little brown mouse? Come for a feast in my log bell house. So the mouse says, it's frightfully nice of you, no snake, but no, I'm having a feast with a gruffalo. So the snake went, ah, oh, gruffalo, what, ah, oh, gruffalo. So the mouse says, ah, oh, gruffalo, why didn't you know? He has no knees and turned out toes and a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. So the snake went, 
Where are you meeting him? And the mouse says, Here, yeah. by this lake, and his favorite food, scrambled snake. Scrambled snake. It's time I hid. Goodbye, little mouse. And away, snake slim. <laughs> Silly old snake. Does he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? But who is this creature with terrible claws and his terrible teeth and his terrible jaws? He has nobly knees and turned out toes and a poisonous water at the end of his nose. His eyes are orange, his tongue is black. He has purple prickles all over his back. Oh, help! Oh, no, it's a gruffalo. So the gruffalo coming out of the woods, you know, when he's saying to the mouse, My favorite food, the gruffalo said, You taste good on a slice of bread. Good, said the mouse. Don't call me good. I'm the scariest creature in the deep, dark woods. So the mouse boasted for the gruffalo. Just walk behind me and soon you'll see. Everyone is afraid of me. So the gruffalo say now, <laughs> All right. So they walked and walked till the gruffalo said, I hear a hiss in the leaves ahead. So the mouse said, Oh, it's Snake. Snake took one look at that gruffalo. So grumps, he said. Goodbye, little mouse. And off he slid into his log pile house. You see, said the mouse, I told you so. Amazing, said the gruffalo. So they walked some more till the gruffalo said, I hear a hoot in the trees ahead. It's owl, said the mouse. Why owl, hello? Owl took one look at that gruffalo. Oh dear, he said. Goodbye, little mouse. And off he flew into his treetop house. You see, said the mouse, I told you so. Hmm, astounding said the gruffalo so they walked some more till the gruffalo said i can hear feet on the part ahead oh it's fox said the mouse why fox hello fox took one look at that gruffalo no oh, crumbs he said goodbye little mouse and off he ran in this underground house so the mouse say now, well, Gruffalo, now you see, everyone is afraid of me. But now my tummy is beginning to rumble, and my favorite food is Gruffalo Crumble. Gruffalo Crumble, and as quick as the wind, the Gruffalo turned and fled. So the mouse tricked the Gruffalo. All was quiet in the deep dark woods. The mouse found a nut, and the nut was good. The end. So, the smartest person in the story is the mouse. The mouse tricked the fox, the snake, the owl, and the hungry gruffalo. So, I hope you enjoy your story time today. Sangha Granny Public Library. Look at the Sangha Granny Public Library Facebook page for more details.